What's up, fam? It's Love Katie B. Back in the building with yet another reaction video of Mom B. This is my mama. And we only react to polys or just nations in general. So for today, fam, do you guys know it's Thursdays on Thursday? <laughs> Sorry, stuffed up a little bit there because my got a little bit of a what's going. Uh, yeah, I'm just so excited for this one. That's why I'm really like stuttering at the moment. So as you guys know, on Thursdays we do. You better say a ladder for the ones in the back, lady. <laughs> Come on, Mom. Throwback Thursday. Yeah, baby. Throwback Thursday. We're not going to try and move too much because last time I got a headache. But <laughs> it's just too much work for me these days. I've been eating a bit too much lately. But yeah, for today we're going to be throwing it back to Micronesia. And for today we're going to be reacting to Rossi Law. Please um, correct me if I've pronounced it wrong in the description box below, please, fams. Previously known as Black Rose. And we're going to be reacting to Why De Ba Ba La Why De ah, See, I was just so excited for this. I was so excited for this. This has been the track for years, you know, like back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, um, just a little bit of history that I also just learned today. Um, these guys, um, Black Rose, started off by doing covers, but really um, made it big when they released their album in 2000, um, which was called Voices of Nature, and where they hit it off with their track um, Raude and Waide Bala, and heaps of other tracks, but um, those two are the main ones that I know. Um, I might have heard some others because we, my uncle did have a CD back in the days that we just mm. played like almost every day. On loop. Yeah, and mm. oh man, I will tell you, if you're in that house, oh, whew. But yeah, oh, crap. We clicked. Yeah. Mm. Like this is, yeah, this is bigger, uh, you know, uh, amongst the Polynesian mm. um, communities and stuff like that. Um, oh, yeah, just Nisians, yeah. Yeah, Pacific. Yeah, Pacific um, Oceania. Mm. <laughs> But us polys are proud to play yeah, it, played in the clubs, yeah. I don't know why I keep yeah, yeah, clubs yeah. up, oh. yeah. not like I go into the clubs. Quite popular, but I fun that's over there. I hated that place. You have never the been? The steps are like... Yeah, does it like, go down or up? Yeah, oh. Oh, up, oh sorry. <laughs> no, it goes sideways. Oh. Even like um, A-Way, it was just, the steps are so steep. Not that I went clubbing. Mm. Like, it was a sober driver. Uh -huh. I'm sure we remember dropping you off one time. Yes. <laughs> right in the middle of Otara. But yeah, I'm so keen to react to these guys. Oh, not react, but you know, just have a little bit of throwback for you guys. If you guys know this track, show them some love. And yeah, I'm not too sure how many band members there are. I think there are like seven or six. But I know that there was one that recently passed away in 2017. So rest in peace to Peter Chong and much love to his family. And yeah, let us know if there's any information we've missed. We'd love to learn a bit more. Mm. But yeah. <laughs> Let's get to the track, baby. Um. Oh, so good. Oh my goodness. If you guys didn't notice how bright this beautiful thing is. <laughs> so for today, we got a bit of a surprise when we went to check our PO box. Um, mad love to One Oak. One Oak, also known as One of a Kind, which is the oak part. One of a kind. Yeah. So oh, um. Bitches. Oh my gosh. If you guys could see the detail, we have some photos going mm. across because there's some poly designs are uh, just you know your poly designs that are sort of embedded behind the camo so um, she's wearing the pink poly camo and i'm wearing the orange poly camo i like it because the material yeah it's wear. gildan i love yeah. gildan man so they do that js and um as colors yeah oh my gosh thank you guys so mm. much man but the the print they print straight onto the fabric which is um dtg which oh, it's yeah. um digital straight onto the garment Oh. Pick them out on Instagram, please. Um, not sure of their Facebook because we don't have Facebook. Yeah. Um, but check them out on Instagram. We'll have pictures running across. Um, also the details down below in the description box, please, fans. Um, they also do vector portraits. Um, sizes A1 and A3. Check them out. Um, really mm. nice. Yeah, I love like how they, really. Yeah. Fuck. I love how they incorporate the island pattern behind. Man, if you guys could see, I don't know if you guys can yeah. see it, I doubt you guys can, but man, it's just amazing. Thank you, One Oak. Thank you. Yeah, thank you heaps, man. You sneaky, sneaky, eh? This is, but yeah, let's get to the track, bro. I just want to get to the track. Oh my god. It's about to be a vibe. Mama B doesn't, you know, obviously doesn't want this house to be here anymore because it's about to get lit. Lit. But let's go. I'm surprised no video, no visuals, eh? Yeah. Oh, mind you. Just 
Okay, just wait a minute. My Siva is coming along. I feel cheeky already, like I want yeah, a drink. Yeah, I know. Somebody get the drinks. Chop, chop. <laughs> you talking to my brother? No, I'm talking to my... Um... Uh, hmm. Mm. <laughs> I'll start that again, because that was just too lit. Whew! Stop. Don't stop it. Please. Okay. Have you ever had a song that just starts and you're already like, Whoa, 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 <laughs> you know? Wait a damn minute, I was ready, you know? Many vlogs. Yeah, many vlogs. If you're watching this, you know the go! Okay. Control also, yourself. check out many vlogs, fams. Control yourself. I can't, I can't. By mm. listening to it all these years, I still don't know that. Like, I, know I even the chorus. yeah, I searched up the lyrics one time and I just I memorized it and then I forgot. So all I know is why, <laughs> but it's still a bang either way. But when I'm drunk, I all of a sudden I know the lyrics. It's like funny. Oh, you drink now? Uh, huh? Eh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> happy song yeah it? like just the beat in general mm. you know i you know music of the islands like you know what i mean just a real happy vibe yeah. makes you want to get up and dance not that hard. yeah i i never knew like you know the meaning of um why de bala and what it was about and stuff like that but let us know i'd love to know a bit of fijian history you know when it, in terms of this song um if it was a remake or it's the original song and stuff like that man also my cream went in my eye but yeah, let's go. You know why? Too much moving around. Hate it, go hate. <laughs>
just love this check it, it gives me a like it like you know how these certain songs that remind you of certain memories like this is one of Brings those back, tracks yeah. yeah like a deja vu memory yeah. like, very oh, nice man. it's unlocking memories that just them it's nice because these are the songs that were a big hit within our you know Asian yeah. community and and everyone loved playing it. Yeah, 100%. You know, you know there was no hate when you listen to music. Mm. When you listen to music, you just, there's mm. no hate. Not like nowadays, it's always yeah. like, oh no, they're tongue in, or they're Samoan. Yeah, I'm over that, that. man. Way come over on. That. Mm. It's just like, oh, you know, it's like that, we should have left that mm. like 50 years ago. It almost has a tongue in vibe to it, eh? Yeah, oh, I guess so. But, oh man. More for you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, you know, because I know a lot of with their language, they pronounce, you know, some certain letters different. Um, well, there was a rugby like player. Yeah. Oh, there was a rugby player in um, All Blacks back in the days. Um, he used to always go, go Rekka Koko! <laughs> go Rekka And then just to find out after calling yeah. Rekka Koko. Yeah. It's not a, it's it's not a C, yeah. It's or pronounced like a TH. And we were just in the game. Wow. <laughs> yeah, when you told me. But it me. was just uh, no. But it was just after that, after being told how it's pronounced, probably we just couldn't. It just we're so used to saying Rekka Koko. Yeah, just yeah, yeah. Saying, <laughs> but around certain people will go, um, go Rekka Koko. Rekka Koko. Go rock. Yeah. <laughs> too. Man. He just, he, not long after we found out that was how it's pronounced, like he just fell off the face of the yeah. earth. I don't know where he is now. But not only is a good song, a bloody good um, players, rugby, eh? rugby players. Just just the song. Oh man. The song, you know. <sighs> man, good memories. Memories, bruv. Memories. But yeah, let us know um, a bit of history, what the song's about and stuff like that. Um, honestly, I'd love to know. And maybe when you see me, I'll see for one time if you hear Melbourne, I'll probably know the words off by heart. Because what else can you do in lockdown? <laughs> mm. But yeah, what? Anything else? Awesome track, fams. Um, make sure you add this to the playlist. If this, make sure you add this to your playlist if this is the first time you've ever heard of it. Um, if it is, well, welcome to the channel, and make sure you go check it out. Um, yeah, we do um throwbacks. We'd like to do songs that are over ten years old mm. and has had an impact within our community, mm. um, you know, good vibey music. Yeah. Like this was huge, mm, huge. And you can feel it when it plays. It just brings, just happy vibes. Heaps, yeah, yeah. heaps of memories and stuff. Mm. Other than that, friends, much love. Stay safe and see you guys in the next video. Bye.